I'm Jeff Ismail with IH Parts America, and this is the Great American IH Build-Off. Right here on Binder TV. Today on the Great American Build-Off, we take it to the West Coast and meet the team at IH Parts America and their 1970 travel all bill. The Great American Build-Off is brought to you in part by Honest Speed Shop and by Old Iron Off-Road. Hey guys, I'm Kendra Summer and welcome to the Great American Build-Off. When we last left off at IH Parts America, we learned that the 1970 Travel All has been a project for the shop for the past 13 years. But now, it's crunch time. Uh, the shop's been real busy. Uh, we've done some work to the Build-Off project. Things been going really well. The guys have been working really hard trying to get the project done. Uh, but even with all their hard work, there are still times when they simply can't get to the project. Just sometimes seeing it sit there and not get worked on and go, you know, the nationals are coming. You know, we got to have this thing done. And You know, it's going to be right up to the time it gets loaded up onto the truck and heading over there. There's always something, little things that got to be done to it. I would just say the amount of ingenuity that goes into it, if everyone can see how much time's been spent to make every little thing work just right, um, they could really appreciate this build and uh, how much time has been put into it, just thousands and thousands of hours. But one good thing is it's now moving under its own power and getting taken out of the shop. Uh, things have been moving right along. I've been working on the travel all a little bit, trying to wrap things up in it. Uh, just as recent as yesterday, took it out, got wheel alignment done. Now it's ready for the owner to come back up for us to start putting some miles on it and do some engine tuning. Now even for a project this far along and so close to being finished, it's not all smooth sailing. There's been a few little hiccups here and there, really just trying to get all the wiring and stuff wrapped up in it and getting everything working properly. We have a little issue with a power steering leak just from sitting probably. So we need to probably pull that out and reseal that up. And then we still have tuning to do to it. So that takes a little time. Just trying to get, you know, get the uh, deadline, uh, you know, coming up. It's coming up quick, so. Even with the challenges ahead, the team is ever confident about their chances of winning the Great American Build-Off. They're, they're all Scout 2s, so we'll have something totally unique and different. I think because it's a travel all versus three scouts, um, there's sometimes people are just like, ah, you know, another scout, another scout, but to see a travel all, it's different. You know, it's just, a, it's not the same, same old, same old. I have a very good chance that we're going to be the winner. You know, our project is just so solid right now that I don't even need to look at the competition. Like this travel all, like once they see it, it'll scare away all the other competition around. Once that thing rolls out of the trailer, it's over. We won. Well, one thing sure hasn't changed since our last visit to IH Parts America, the confidence for the win at this year's Scout Nationals. And coming up next episode, we're back at Scout Co. to see how husband and wife duo Mike and Jennifer Moore are doing on their 1974 Scout entry. I'm Kendra Summer. Thanks for watching The Great American Build-Off. For Pete's sakes, Kendra.